my channel. Today's video is just a cosy little collective haul. I thought I would do like a little haul of all the bits I've been recently getting because I don't really do too many clothes hauls at the moment. We're all about the food on this channel and the home stuff. But I have been buying like a few bits of clothes here and there from like Primark, Next, H&M, like those kind of stores and they're really really nice clothes and I thought I would show you just a few of the bits that I have been recently buying as well as some like Christmassy bits for the home and a few, a couple of bits that I've been sent also that I wanted to show, not that I've been asked to, I just wanted to do like a nice cosy traditional sit down Christmassy 2019 haul. Get your cosy Christmas drinks. I've gone with a black tea today because it's the morning so I normally drink tea in the morning in my favourite festive mug. Can you believe we are doing this again? I'm so excited. And if you are new to the channel by the way, my name is Sophie. I make three videos on this channel every single week on Tuesdays, Thursdays and Sundays all about living your best life on a budget. So I would subscribe to join the most positive and helpful community here on YouTube. Yeah. Let's go. Okay, something I recently went to Primark for was pajamas. I'm not joking. I don't really go to Primark too often, but when I do, that 90% of the time that I'm there, I'm actually spending in the PJ section. I noticed that Primark actually do like quite a lot of clothes that are recycled cotton now, which is really good. So they have lots of conscious fashion. So a few of the bits that I have actually picked up from Primark are from the recycled section. We will start with the most festive PJs you will see 2019. These PJs are really, really festive. Oh my gosh, I fell in love with them as soon as I saw them. They are just navy PJs that say merry and bright and they've got like the really traditional old fashioned look looking Christmas lights all over them. They're really giving me Stranger Things vibes. I absolutely love them. I did put a picture of myself wearing these up on Instagram a couple of days ago and you guys went mad for them. They're definitely going to be popular this year. I'm so glad I got them. I purchased mine in a size, I believe small, which is a UK size 8 to 10. So UK size 8 to 10. And yeah, I'm not going to lie, I have worn these a few times already. Okay, I, I picked up a new coat. Oh my flipping goodness. This is definitely going to be my favourite coat of this season. This is a gorgeous like tweed style jacket, I would say, you call it. It's absolutely massive like the coat is humongous i can't even explain it comes down to just above my ankles i did buy it in uk size 8 it's a good style i definitely think it's a style right now this was 35 pounds like a bit a bit steep for primark but it's really good quality it's also in the stacy solomon collab with primark so it's really nice and i flipping love it it's got this gorgeous like mustardy dark browns in it and some more christmas pjs that i purchased from primark which miraculously i have not opened yet gorgeous just like a red long sleeve top with some reindeer trousers with reindeers and christmas trees i absolutely love these i think they're so cute so festive they're also again from the ethical range which is made with sustainable cotton just giving me all the christmasy vibes i really like these also they make fabulous Christmas presents. If you're anything like me, Christmas PJs being your Christmas presents is like the best thing you can receive. Also, again, PJ wise, I do have other clothes, by the way, I will show you in a sec. But I picked up these gorgeous grey and white Fair Isle, again, made with ethical cotton PJs. And oh my gosh, I've already worn them, hence why they're out of the package. But these are so soft. I can't even describe to you how soft these are. They are actually really good quality. Sometimes like the quality from Primark is a bit hit and miss, but these are really good quality. I really like them. It was actually 10 pound for this set. I mean, you can't go wrong. It's so affordable. You just... I also had a little browse around their home section and I purchased this 100% cotton, brushed cotton bed sheet mattress cover. This bed sheet is in Jersey material, AKA it's so soft, so warming, so nice i just really liked it it's white with gold stars and i just thought it'd look really cute i do have lots of other jersey bedding that i've already bought from previous years i also purchased this absolutely beautiful uh what is it called like a pinny for like a denim pinny for this is from their sustainable section it's in a uk size 10 i'm normally a uk size 8 but i would recommend sizing up for this this is so nice i've worn it once so far and it was really nice fitting like it felt really nice to wear 
Um, I like how it's like really square neck and it covers like your entire boobs. Sometimes I wear pinafores and it doesn't cover my entire boobs and I feel like there's just too much going on. So this is really nice because it like covers here but also gives you a nice figure. I just really like this. I feel like it's gonna be the perfect winter attire. Just this with some roll necks underneath, some tights, some boots, a nice big coat. I just really, really like it. I also, for £2.50, picked myself up from Primark some new cosy slipper socks. Are you really going to Primark if you don't pick up some cosy slipper socks? These are little festive bunnies and they were only £2.50 for these. They are super soft, thick and they have the little dotty bits. <laughs> don't know how else to describe them. Dotty bits at the bottom so if you're running around you don't fall over. I picked up some little fairy lights, little uh, tea lights, that's what they're called. These are Christmas tree silver birch tea lights from Primark and they smell good. Like, they actually smell good. Normally I'm a little bit fussy about where I get my candles from just because I feel like if you get like the super duper cheapy ones, they don't normally smell as nice as say if you treated yourself to like a really nice Yankee candle. And I also picked up some more beauty blenders because I'm not being funny, but I've only really ever had one branded beauty blender. The rest I just buy at Primark because they're really good. <laughs> I really like them. I popped into H&M and I picked up this gorgeous navy blue jumper, which I absolutely love. This was 20 pounds and it's in that material that reminds me of like films from the 90s, like that soft velvety material, but it's a bit like a waffle throw. I can't even explain it. I really liked it. It's kind of cropped as well. It's not like cropped cropped, but it goes up to your hips and then you'll have your jeans. So I thought that would be like quite a cool outfit. It's a little bit of a high neck, which will keep you warm throughout the autumn and winter. And I bought mine in a size medium. I just really liked it. They did actually have other colors, but I felt like this is kind of a universal color. Um, I could wear this at all times. And also from H&M, they are so good at the basic range, like just basic long sleeve top. I purchased this long sleeve ribbed dark red like maroon style top. This top actually goes really well under the Primark pinafore. I did actually wear that in a video um, that went live a couple of days ago so you may have seen that outfit. £12.99 it's really good quality it fits really well. From next I picked up first of all this absolutely gorgeous sweater. Now if you are new to the channel you may not know I'm obsessed with bumblebees and like bees in general. I just think they're the best. And this jumper has bees on, which is so cute because normally you only see bee stuff around summer, but this is like a really autumnal, wintry colored sweater. And then it has bees on, so <laughs> representing the bee life. Just loved it. It's actually 22 pounds for this sweater. I've really noticed that it really suits Lawrence. He actually tried this on and it really suits him. So, um, I would say that could be a Christmas present for like a boyfriend, a brother. It just looks really nice. And from next also, I picked up this gorgeous mustard sweater. Like it's like kind of a long sleeve, nice top, nice cotton top. And it's got these little gold jeweled bits like in the sweater, just making it a little bit more something something. You know what I mean. This is in a UK size eight. I really like this. It was 30 pounds. It is such a nice fit. Um, I would get your own size, like don't size up or size down if you want it to look nice with a pair of jeans. I just... And also from H&M, I bought myself a new scarf, a mustard goldy type scarf. This looks really nice. It was only £10 and I thought something like this I would wear year after year after year. I'm quite good at like keeping my clothes. Draw your attention back to B and M. I went to B and M because so many of you guys have my back and you told me the new Sephora's are in B and M. So I actually bought all three new Christmas Sephora's. These are so nice smelling, they smell like candles. I'm not even just saying it, if you have also bought these scents, you will know I'm telling the truth, particularly the warm cinnamon. I just love anything cinnamon smelling at this time of year, it's the ultimate, like, isn't it the best? Ah, oh, guys. You may have seen this like all around other YouTube channels, but I really wanted to mention it in today's video. I was sent the Glossy Box Advent Calendar, Christmas Advent Calendar for this year, and oh my gosh, are you okay? Am I okay? Are they okay? It's so nice. The products in here are so good. I did have a browse on the little leaflet that comes with the package, and the products are insane. I do actually have a discount for 
Paul glossy box um, for you guys. I will leave down below if you ever want to treat yourself to anything from there. If you want to have a monthly subscription box from there. If you want to buy the advent calendar and that's it, then you can use my code. I'll leave all the details down below for you. I'll open box number one for you. Um, I won't open the whole thing because you might not want to see it. Door number one, you get an NYX palette like those colors are a bit of me they're all nude neutrally colors no like bright crazy colors i would treat yourself scales i would treat yourself and also a company called fab fit fun sent me one of their wintery luxury boxes so these boxes are like a subscription box as well but they're a little bit more expensive because they have like more luxury items in but the items honestly um for what it's worth i've left all the details about how much this is and what it's worth and blah 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 down below but the items in here are amazing you get like a lovely cheese board with gold cutters and cheese servers a salt and pepper grinder which i think is so cool we have a gorgeous plush lovely blue and white scarf like how nice is this a whole new scarf i'm so happy with this also some gorgeous ear crawlers from the company ball blair ball 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 bar it's a new york based company and these ear crawlers look lovely they just look really nice um we have some juice cleanse exfoliating the salt cubes we have hair repair from avida damage remedy stuff we have human and kind body souffle wow that smells good so yeah i just thought i would bring that to your attention in case you also wanted something like this you could treat yourself to this for christmas okay guys so that is everything in today's cozy little christmas haul if you want me to do like some sit down type hauls like this more often then do let me know in the comments down below i'm thinking of doing some gift guides as well and um, because i know that aldi are actually having a lot of gift type things in their special buy section coming up in the next couple of weeks and i definitely want to do a gift guide from there but let me know in the comments down below what what you would like to see i hope you enjoyed don't forget to subscribe if you are not already and give the video a thumbs up because it really helps my channel out and i will see you again on sunday for a very very exciting video it is a christmas food challenge video Mwah. bye